Hey guys, it's me, Gary Lee Stanley, your sales guy. <laughs> Today we're going to talk about our favorite subject, which is sales. All right. Our question, our subject for today is how to market yourself, how to sell yourself to your customers and to the public. I'm going to tell you what, I've been in sales a long time and I have been able to market myself in many, many different ways. But, you know, once I got into real estate, it was like really I started looking at my life and trying to figure out ways to make more money, honey. And a lot of it has got to do with marketing. Now, a lot of times you may work for a company and stuff like that. They may give you some, you know, some real nice business cards if you're lucky, or you may have to go out and buy your own, especially when you're in sales because, see, we work for ourselves. We really do. And you may say, well, I work for a company. Well, you really work for yourself. So you really need to get some good marketing. You may say, well, I work in a showroom where I sell furniture and stuff like that. Why do I need to know anything about marketing? Let me just give you a heads up people come into your store and it would be nice if they knew your name it would be probably really nice if you had a whole lot of people knowing who you are and i'm gonna tell you what you really do need to learn how to market yourself i don't care if you sell in a showroom uh, in a car dealership at a location where you're in retail people they will come and buy from you if they know that you're selling a particular product maybe you're a person who's out there selling uh you you know insurance life insurance and stuff like that maybe you're a person who's selling real estate and i started thinking about this subject because it's like marketing is such a big deal when it comes to selling we need this thing called referrals and if you are a salesperson and you want to make a tremendous amount of money or make a lot more money or even more money you really do need to learn how to market yourself you know companies they put out their marketing materials a lot of times they'll send out flyers they'll send out you know stuff in the mail they'll send out advertisements and stuff like that but see that's going to get a bulk of business for the company it's not got your name written on it doesn't tell anybody about who you are and why they should be calling on you so today I decided I'm going to talk about this subject of marketing what is marketing marketing is letting people know hey I'm in the business I do a particular business and you want to call on me because I'm the guy that's going to help you get the deal I want to help you get the best sell price I want to make sure that I make sure that you're going to get everything that you want and more so just remember guys just because you may work for a company that's already doing marketing what are you doing to market yourself that's a little bit different than everybody else a lot of times people you know we're all the same but <laughs> we're really not See, for myself, like, you know, since I've been in real estate now, I started learning how marketing really works more than you think. You know, by marketing yourself, like I said, you're letting people know that you're in the business of selling a particular product. Now, if you're a person, don't matter what you sell, it could be pool services, it could be whatever, real estate, land, it could be you're selling, you know, like I said, in, a, in an environment where people are coming to your store, and you want to be the person that they call on. You don't want them just to go up to your to your store or you get busy, go to your company and don't ask for you. You want a piece of that pie. So what I do is I market myself in many different ways. And one of the ways is like I do, I do farming of a community. If you have a store in a location or you can market, you know, door to door and business to business and letting people know you hand out your business card, maybe a flyer. That's a really cool way. If you're working in a, in, a, in a store like furniture, for instance, okay, you can go within a one mile radius and hand out flyers to the different people that are in the thing. Let them know about sales. You may say, man, that's a lot of work. Well, let me tell you what. You want to get more sales, you have to go to work. You have to do things that a lot of people don't do. And I use Facebook, which is a really good uh, opportunity. You can go ahead and do live videos. Hey, I'm the furniture guy right here in uh, wherever you're at and say, hey, listen, you know, I, I know you might be looking for furniture, but I know you didn't know that I was selling it. And my name is whoever you are. Let people know. It could be insurance. Hey, guys, I sell life insurance. I'm in a particular area. And if you need some or if you know anybody who has any questions, you're marketing yourself. I also do a lot more than that. I do YouTube videos. I, I do this for my customers and I market, you know, their home 
problems in this regard. But if you have a product, you can go ahead and start learning that marketing yourself. You know, you've got Instagram, you've got, you know, all these different websites that people love to congregate, even these younger ones where people like to congregate, and you can share your little short little video telling people about who you are. I mean, matter of fact, what you can do is you can get this thing called a sphere of influence, and you can send a text to every single person in your little Rolodex, a little 30-second text, hey, me, you know, he goes, hey, it's me, Gary, I, I was just thinking about you today, you know, uh, we've got a sale going on at my store, you might want to check it out, or maybe if you're a, a, a real estate salesperson, or if you're a person who sells, you know, insurance, or just what basically anything you just send a short little message hey about 25 seconds you won't be able to do it probably any longer than that of a little advertisement hey let you know guys hey man it's me gary i got a sale going on today you might want to give me a call at your telephone number and really you're going to save some money we got the best deal selling jewelry or whatever you're selling marketing yourself gives you an advantage over your competitors you're probably going wow i can market myself and make more money it's really true and there's a lot of free ways that you can market yourself like I said you know you do have to get yourself a, maybe a website you know a domain name so that way you can actually have people go directly to your website you got to let everybody know who's in your sphere of influence you know if you go to church or if you're a part of a, a group you share that hey this is what I do marketing makes a difference if you're wanting to make real money and selling <laughs> you can't just wait for somebody to come to you you got to go out to them you've got to make sure that people know that you're in the business like I said I get on Facebook and I let people know hey I do a lot of videos and I let them know hey I'm with uh, you know exit real estate gallery I sell you know real estate today and I also make myself valuable and I give them a, 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 a greeting and let my friends and people know that are out there that hey I've got some important Important information that can save you money, time, and energy. And if you are looking to buy or sell a house, see what I'm saying, guys? There's just a lot of different ways. Or if you got like your furniture salesperson, I got this deal. Oh my goodness, guys, we're getting ready to have a uh, weekly this week sale. We're going to save 50% off. We got the packages, we've got the discounts on all this and this. You can actually do that on Facebook you know live and let people know hey man this is what i do you can also do a youtube channel matter of fact you can start marketing your youtube channel talking about a particular if you're selling furniture you can talk about furniture if you're about selling cars you can talk about selling cars and you can start marketing yourself and letting people know that i've got a channel and people are interested they want to see stuff so what i'm trying to do for you today guys is just give you some insight that marketing is more than just sending out advertisements. Like I said, I go door to door and business to business. I let people know who I am. I do a lot of different things, you know, like Instagram and stuff like that and let people know what market I'm in. I also talk about my businesses. I talk about all the products and things that I offer. I also give people the, you know, give them some knowledge, you know, don't browbeat people, send out texts, do selfies and send out, you know, messages. And you want to be personable with people, especially if you're texting, you know. And a lot of times if you're looking to sell something or if you're looking to be really good, marketing is, gives you the capability to do almost anything. You know, you can send out flyers, you know, in a community or even these things called door hangers. If you are working in a particular neighborhood or a community or an area, you can hang door hangers and you can also can do that you can get some kids to go knock on the doors or should i say just hang them on the doors pay them some really nice little bit of money and put it out there in the community you can send out notes and stuff to people that you've run into you can go into business and people and work with those people and you know ask you know do you know anybody who might be interested in my particular product and it's like the, the more you put yourself out there, the more marketing that you do, the more people that you that know about your products, the more opportunities happen to drop into your lap. I'm just saying it don't matter what product you sell unless it's something that's really technical and, you know, most people can't afford it or they won't be able to buy it. But I'm talking to people who are regular salespeople who are selling products and stuff. Let people know what you do. You got to get excited about what you do, but you got to market yourself. You got to tell people what you do. And I 
I get all excited, and sometimes I'll play a game with it and stuff like that. I'll go into my different offices, show them where I work, show them the different locations and stuff that I work at. I talk about, you know, you know all the, the features and benefits, why they should want to work with me. I talk to them about different things, and I, I bring value to, you know, whatever they're watching. If I send, I want them to, to, to have value in why they should even take a few seconds and watch my little short videos and stuff because if you people perceive that you're going to bring value to the table i mean it makes all the difference in the world and like say for instance for me if it's a first-time buyer i'll talk about a first-time buyers program if i'm doing an open house i'll talk about the open house i also go and you know show pictures and videos of the products now if i was selling furniture right now what i would be doing is i would show my advertisement for that week i would talk about my advertisement and why they should and make sure they know where you're at and you want to talk about yourself because what you're doing is you're giving yourself a platform to make more money marketing is a really cool thing it really really is a lot of times you know people just hand out business card y'all come see me or they wait for the company to go ahead and send out a bunch of flyers and stuff and then you're just waiting for the sale and they may give you some leads here and there, but how do you build your business? You got to think outside the box. You got to really think about marketing yourself, being out there, being in front of the public. You know, I even have magnets and stuff on the side. I got four big giant magnets on the side of my car with me doing the thumbs up, talking about me as a real estate agent. Also, it don't matter. You could be selling furniture. You could be selling almost anything. And when people see those magnets, they will, you know, eventually that might help draw them. They'll see that magnet over and over and over and people are drawn. And like I said, guys, you really do have to think outside the box. You're salespeople. I don't care what kind of product you sell. Marketing makes a difference. I mean, would you rather talk to one or two people or 50 to 100? But it takes time. You got These people got to see your marketing and they've got to see it again and again and again. Because they say between 12 and 13 times when somebody's seeing your marketing, they can reflect and they say, I don't know, I got this one particular company that sends me advertisements every month about insurance. Every single month, they'll send out an advertisement and just talk about who they are and everything. And guess what? I went and signed up with them because I got some advertisement. They were marketing through the mail. But people are marketing through emails now. Emails are really good. You know, it's pretty good. Sometimes people won't look through them or anything. So you've got to think outside the box. I do texting with, with uh, you know great information for my customers. Short little, little video to let them know who I am. I do the Instagram. I do... I do uh, you know, a lot of different other ones. Oh, I'm getting a little brain dead right this second, but there's quite a few that I'll get on there and I'll shoot it out to people, especially like Facebook. I'll let people know what I'm doing. I do the YouTube and I do quite a few more things other than that. So if you're looking to get into sales, but you're wanting to build your business, you're wanting to make more money, you got to think, like I said, outside the box. You got to think smart. You got to get out there and do stuff that people don't really think about. You've got to start shaking hands or maybe fist bumps now with the, the COVID, everything is crazy. But fist bumps, you know, just, you know, go places that you hadn't thought to because the only way you're going to create value or business is you're going to have to get out there and shake some trees, shake some hands or fist hands. And I, even in the grocery stores and the restaurants and stuff like, like that, put your name in flyers. And like I said, there are different pla placemats and stuff that you can put your name on. There's a lot of different ways to market. And I would actually... And I and Google or duck and, and check out the word marketing. What does it mean? It means, you know, you want people to see who you are. Okay. And they want, you want these folks to buy from you. So I hope you enjoyed this little short video. It's just important that it sells people. We don't think just because, you know, uh, we work for a company or something like that, that we can't market ourselves. Yes, we can. If you're selling a product, it could be, you know, you're working for a pool company or a pest control company and you want people to know who you are not the other sales people but you get out there and market yourself make those get those those placards for the side of your car when you're driving and bills and business have your business cards with you all the time get those door hangers and flyers and stuff made up with your name on it with your telephone number and you go out there and knock on doors put stuff on people's you know you know you can't put nothing in nobody's mailbox but you can send out literature and stuff like that because see marketing makes money okay but but it takes a little bit of time, so be patient. And you might.
might be surprised. You may put out some some stuff and you get some instant people contacting you because they're interested in whatever product you're trying to sell. And this could be for a small business owner. You're a small business owner and you've got a service that you're trying to put out there. They've got these mint magazines and all these other magazines and stuff, but why don't you do your own? Why don't you just let people know? I do a service. I can do carpet work. I do cleaning. I'm a, I, I'm a, I do a carpentry. I do plumbing. Let people know and then market yourself. You can do it on all these different platforms and let people know that, hey, this is what I do for a living. And I'd love to be able to do it for you. <laughs> so boom, boom. Hey, if you own your own business, you're a salesperson too, guys. And if you're a salesperson, you work in, I don't care. You can work in retail. You can work in insurance. You can work in whatever type, you know, car sales or whatever. But you need to start letting people know who you are. Do you want to make more money? You better damn learn about marketing and how to market your stuff. Okay, you got to sell something. So get out there and sell something. Have a wonderful day. My name is Gary Lee Stanley. Give me a thumbs up and make sure you let people know about me and subscribe. Hope you had a wonderful day. Our total subject for today was how to market, okay, yourself. All right.